So this time a group of friends decided to see who could balance themselves the longest with their eyes closed. And the results are on one foot. So got that part. And the results are listed here. So first we want to make our dot plot. So we've got 21, 21, 23, 11, 48, 21 again, 16, so 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 15, and 13. So what's an outlier on this one, right? So what number is so far away from the rest of them? So one person did awesome and did 48 seconds, but the rest of them are in the 10s and 20s, right? That's the outlier. It's not like the rest of them. So now we want to find the mean, median, and mode with, with the outlier. So we've got 10, and then let's, I'm oh, sorry, nope, that's 11. I'm already off to a bad start here. 11, 13, 15, 16, and then we've got 21 three times. So one, two, three. We've got a 23 and a 48. So to find the mean, I add these all up and divide by the students. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine students. To find the middle, I'm going to match them up and find the median until I get to the middle. And then the mode is the one that happened the most is 21. So now we're going to do that same thing. So we've got 11, 13, 15. Oh, I did not want to write that one and then wrote a gigantic one. 16, 21, 21 again, 21 again, and a 23. So I'll add these up or take this total and just minus 48 from it. And this time I'm dividing by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 to find the mean, the fair share. Now my median, 11 matches to 23, 13 to 21, 15 and 21. So I'm left with 16 and 21 in the middle here. So I need to find the fair share of 16 and 21. So I add these up and I know if it's an, even, or an odd number, I just need to add a zero. So, it's, so see how many times two goes into 37 and that is your median. And then our mode, same thing, is still 21. So this time, what do you think is least representative of the data? So is there a number that just really, when you found each of these, it just really stuck out like, wait, that doesn't quite seem right. Again, with the outlier, finding that mean is going to kind of push it over here because this one is so high. It's pushing everything over. It's got to share more, more, more. And it's not a, probably a good representation if you have a number in your mean that didn't occur in your data or wasn't close to it. So not those outliers can really kind of mess with our data there.